heat, sun, and illness. All I see is bodies roaming the savanna in search of food, shelter, and survival. But all there is is stones and more stones. Ten years have passed and thousands of patients. Ten, fifteen, or thirty expeditions. I've lost count. The countless wounded and disabled resemble beasts, deathly African pathologies, hours and hours of work in the operating room, mutual suffering, both alien and heartfelt, fill the harsh, rocky, and inhospitable plains, sand, red, covered in blood, thick, sweet, and red. And there it was, amidst a gazillion pages in the dictionary, the big, bold T of trauma. Trauma, a lasting injury from a generally external mechanical agent, emotional shock that causes lasting damage to the unconscious. Negative emotion, strong and lasting impression. Now I have discovered a new synonym, one that defines the emotions I continuously feel when I look into my Nikon journal. Club feet, deformed, twisted and burned. Mutated arms, rotting legs, and exposed bone. Putrid air fills my lungs. Exposed membranes, exploding tumors, cleft lips. Everyone, everywhere, crippled and maimed. Whole regiments. Long days, beautiful nights, mosquitoes, sick people, more mosquitoes, wounded and disabled. Why would I come back to Africa, to Togo? You ask absurd questions. I know, you know. And he knows there are things in this life that exist only because without them, our lives wouldn't be so fucking amazing. Live your life and live it well, limitless, without regrets, as our beloved Africa, the real Africa, the one that hurts your throat as you try to swallow, the one made of pain friendship, solidarity, and grief. The Oasis, Africa, six letters, one after another, 10 years, one after another. Tick tock, tick tock, time flies, life goes on. You either lead your own life or sit back and let it pass right by you. The Africa that once seduced you from within, from the depths of your soul. We cannot deny it. We should not want to deny it, let alone forget. As someone much wiser once said, light breaks where no sun shines, where no sea rises. The waters of the heart push the tides where evil grows is also the same place where that which saves us blooms. Oasis, full of joy, hidden smiles,
pretty light. 